Hi there. So in this video, we will see how to display a PDF document inside your WordPress post. Okay. So for this, I'm going to use plugin named PDF Viewer. So go to your plugins tab, click on add new. This should take you to your plugins page and here you can search for PDF Viewer. Tap in PDF Viewer in search box and you will be presented with options. Choose this PDF Viewer from NVGeek Web Services. Click on it. Click install now and this should install your PDF Viewer. There are a few other plugins as well, but for the sake of simplicity, I'm using this PDF Viewer plugin. It takes some time to download and install depending on your internet connection speed. Okay, click on activate plugin. Click on settings and here you'll find default settings set up for your PDF viewer. The width and height is specified here. You can keep it as is if you don't want any other different width and height within your post. Okay. It also has disable IE support. So if you don't want to support all the versions of Internet Explorer, you can type the specific name here okay also there is disabled notice just in case if your browser doesn't support pdf view in that case this notice will appear okay now we are going to add one pdf within our post so i'm going inside posts tab click on all posts And here I'm going to choose this okay and now I'm going to add PDF inside this post so let it load and here you will find some space within your post you can simply Add the media, <coughs> choose media library and choose the PDF file that you uploaded. Copy the URL okay now click on text tab and scroll to the point where you want to add that PDF viewer and use the short code PDF viewer give the URL to your PDF and close the shortcut so this short code will allow you to show PDF within your page so make sure that the URL in between the short code start and end points to the exact address where your PDF file is stored Okay, now save your post. Okay, and you can now view that post. Okay, let me scroll down to see that file. Okay, here you can see the PDF viewer added one specific PDF viewer for my document. You can use multiple options here, such as zooming the content and zooming out. I can also specify the page to go. Also, 
click on previous and next page and toggle the sidebar and one more options for tools which will give you additional options such as printing this or downloading etc so if you are using your website or blog for some educational content you can use this pdf viewer for that purpose simply download pdf viewer plugin and use short code pdf viewer and within that block use your pdf url you can also specify external pdf url if you want you don't necessarily have to have upload in your own server so this was our short video on how to use pdf viewer in wordpress